Father, please help me deliver this smoothly through the Holy Ghost. In Jesus' name, I do pray. Amen. Okay, I just want to uh, show Jonathan about the reversal he uses in Scripture. Okay, and one way he does is by pinpoint, uh, pickpocketing a, a scripture without um, going through the chapter and showing who's talking to who, under what form, and, you know, just the particulars. Because uh, one, one verse does not prove itself as well. So... Jesus said unto them, Verily, verily, I say unto you, Before Abraham was, I am. So, this is an indication of someone to be at another time, and also at this time, in the present time. Okay. So, we've got uh, a statement here. And... Uh, I forgot to set this up, so please bear with me. Um, uh, Jeremiah 1.1, 1, 1, let's go. Okay, and we're going to follow through with the scripture, just on this little part here. The book of the prophet Jeremiah. Chapter 1. The words of Jeremiah, the son of Hilkiah, of the priests that were in Anathoth in the land of Benjamin to whom the word of the Lord came in the days of Josiah, the son of Ammon, king of Judah, in the thirteenth year of his reign. It came also in the days of Jehoiakim, the son of Josiah, king of Judah, unto the end of the eleventh year of Zedekiah, the son of Josiah, king of Judah, unto the carrying away of Jerusalem captive in the fifth month. Then the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Before I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. And before thou cameth forth out of the womb, I sanctified thee, and I ordained thee a prophet unto the nations. Then said I, Ah, Lord God, behold, I cannot speak, for I am a child. That is the way I feel. I, I do not speak well. But anyways, <clears throat> okay. So before I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. How's that possible? Well, there's a couple things here we really have to dig into. Who's talking? Who formed us? Jesus. So, Jesus said, Okay, well, let's go. Before Jesus formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. Well, the other way they knew uh, somebody was through marriage. Okay, and that's a man and a woman. But we're talking about angel to angel. Because he was once an angel. And he fell. And he was put in a dimension until he passed through the woman's womb. See, like I said, the way I explain scriptures, I can go through it as smooth as can be. But you're all over the place. And... You, and uh, I will bring up that because the Lord just told me to do it. But anyways, um, you try and explain yourself. You have to say things two and three times, four times, because tell them, tell them, show them, tell them. Okay. But with scriptures, you just have to go through it and it explains itself. So. The scriptures that I can give concerning, I said Moses became John the Baptist and now has no longer a body. In scriptures, you can see that it is possible to be from another time and still be in the present time. Jesus said, Okay, now this is a is a reversal or a shuffle or whatever you want to call it. A play with words too. Because he's he's letting you think what through the words that he is speaking. Okay? But he's not speaking the words of scripture. 
okay? Or you could be at another time in this time and, you know, it sounds like Kamala Harris, really. <laughs> but um, I can't understand why people cannot see this. Okay, so Jesus was before because he was with, with in the Father from the beginning. So let's go to here. Okay, Jeremiah 1. That was before I formed. Whoops, come on, let's get in there. Before I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee. And before thy camest, uh, cometh forth out of the womb, that's what they call the matrix, I sanctified thee. And look up matrix in the, the King James, because the other ones take it out. And I ordained thee a prophet unto the nations. Well, they were talking to Jeremiah, so we know that that was this one. Okay? So... Jesus knew Jeremiah before Jeremiah was in the belly. How do you explain that? Re as you call that reincarnation? No, it's not. When Lucifer fell, and this is about, we'll go with the gods too. So, <clears throat> Lucifer. And Jonathan Nolan would specifically use Lucifer's name when Satan's name is supposed to be used because it's in the fallen state. But he'll say Lucifer in the garden or this and that, which it was Satan in the garden. And that's another one of his reversals. Okay, if you go back while well, he's, he, he takes away his video so you can't call him out on what he said. He, he said that before too, but you can't prove it unless you videotaped it. But anyways, <clears throat> uh, he uses that reversal and I was speaking about something else. It doesn't matter. It'll come up later anyways. Um, his reversals Lucifer okay when Lucifer was in uh, was in in charge he was a god a cherub okay all the sons of God are gods okay this is a, this is the family and Lucifer was in charge and Jesus was with the father so Luce, uh, all the angels were f going to Lucifer or whatever. A, a third of them were deceived by his uh, his teachings or his de uh, commands or demands or whatever you want to say. And a third followed him and fell. Well, some were deceived and some were not deceived. These are all gods. Also, morning stars. Because Jesus says in uh, Revelations 22... Or uh, Revelations 2, 26 or 28. I'm not sure. I think it's 26. Uh, I will give you the morning star. Read the full chapter because uh, it it's talks about uh, the letter to the churches. And what you need to do to achieve salvation. The inheritance is the morning star, which are gods. Okay. The gods is the family of the God, the Father. So... There's, uh, we can call, we'll explain it through Elohim, gods and ma God and magistries. So the capital G is the owner, and the small G is what he owns. Gods and magistries. Sorry, I have been out. Let my eyes closed to picture this in my head, as I was explaining in my early videos, and that's why I put my hand on my forehead because I explained in that video how. I was shy to speak at first, and Jonathan Nolan uses it against me, okay, because I was never a speaker. I had a very hard time with the English language because it's uh, a language of deception. But anyways, and God's is one, when, as soon as you say God, you're, de you're deceived because you don't know if it's the father, the son, or the fallen, okay? So a third of the angels fell. And they were put into a dimension, had to come through the mother's womb and live a life for repentance. And then after that, you die once. A man is, uh, is, is made for a man to die once, uh, to be raised, to be judged, and then, uh, and then to be judged. Okay, so that's the verse. I don't know where it is, and I never thought about it before. But So there's no reincarnation. So however you try and manipulate this, 
You cannot prove it with scripture. And you will not prove it with scripture. And this is why it, right here. Okay. Let's go. Uh, bu -bu 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 -bu. It's not too far away. Okay. Let's do it this way. There's my writing on morning stars. Okay. My little. Grab the. Um, understanding. You can check it out yourself. Um, sermon on the web. It's right there. Okay, let's go right here. Okay. This is what he has such a an anal for. Okay, it's my sermon on the web. This is the full writing that I was passing around uh, to Jonathan Kleck and all these other the people I was speaking about uh, in 2013. Um, Jacob Israel was one of them. Um, the four C's is just a little something that I, I was spoken, how things were going to go. Um, chaos, confusion, cooperation, and then Christ Jesus. That's the the way the Antichrist is what will work. And it says, And the book is delivered to him that is not learned, saying, Read this, the whole thing. I pray thee. And he saith, I am not learned. Wherefore the Lord, Lord said, For as much as this, these people do draw near me with their mouth and with their lips, they do, uh, oops, lips do honor me, but have removed their heart from me. And their fear towards me is taught by the percept of men. And that's you, Jonathan Nolan. Therefore, behold, I will proceed. And you want to be put into the scriptures and you want to make yourself uh, like the scriptures all around you? Well, there's one right there, okay? The percept of men. It's not the percept of, of the scriptures. It's not this, what the scripture is saying. It's what you think. Therefore, behold, I will proceed to do marvelous works amongst the people. And that's why I pray before and after every video, at, or in the beginning or at the end of every video. Even a marvelous, because the beginning and the end is the Alpha and the Omega, Jesus Christ. A marvelous work and a wonder, for the wisdom of their wise men shall perish. And the understanding of the prudent man shall be hid. And that's you. Okay, the prudent man. And, you know, Second uh, Peter 1, 17 through 21. Okay, this is um, uh, the father speaking. This is my beloved son, who I am well pleased. And the voice which came from heaven, we heard. When we are with him in the Holy Mount, Mount, so Jesus was with the Father before he was born in the in the, in the flesh. Okay, so now this is another a thing that he can't explain. Okay, Jesus, when Adam and Eve were talking to Jesus in the garden, well, Adam and then Adam and Eve, before the sin, they were light beings, gods. Okay, they could live forever and they eat from the tree of life, but they could not eat from the tree of good and evil because they would be like gods, like one of us, as they were created in the image of God, male and female, Adam, and they split, the split was for procreation after the father's creation, because you're not allowed to create in the father's house, and that's why it's called woman, and the woman power because she wants to create. Okay, now I can go on and on, but it's not. This is uh, Ezra's, uh, where it says, "Who is uh, more powerful, the king, the wine, or the woman?" And uh, the one who answered was the woman was because everything goes to the woman, right? The man's weakness is his sex. 
so is the woman's weakness too. But the woman can control the man or defeat the man through sex like uh, Sam Samson and Goliath and there's others. But anyways, get back to what to, uh, we are at. There's no such thing as reincarnation and Jesus was before um, the earth was created because Jesus created it. Through his father. Before Abraham was I am. And furthermore, when they were talking about... So, Jesus was the first creation of the father. So, when Abraham was born, Jesus knew him before that. But he was created after Jesus. Okay? And it's the pecking order. And Lucifer was in charge of the angels, so maybe he was the next created. He was made the best, the most powerful. Uh, and that's um, Isaiah and Ezekiel. Uh, I kept, I'm going to be guessing if I say any more. But anyways... Um, there was, and this is what uh, Sermon on the Web uh, explains, one, two, and three, and why Jonathan Nolan has such a problem with it is because I use the scripture to explain it, and he cannot defeat it. And Jonathan Click was using it, but he changed that Satan had uh, children with the Eve, um, Cain's uh, uh, bloodline got Past, it was smarter than God and got past the flood uh, when all they had to do was mate with the woman again and they cr created giants um, that the fallen angels that will not be forgiven because they're planning this plan with Lucifer uh, they left their first estate um, and there's more there's, there's so much more I was just trying to organize it quickly uh, of Jesus, are you this or that person? He didn't rebuke them for it. How do you know he didn't? All you know is what the scripture said. Okay? And let's get to it. But the Lord said unto me, Say Oh yeah, we can listen to that while we're waiting. That's unto the end of the eleventh year of Zedekiah, the son of Josiah, want to go here, Judah, here. Unto the carrying away of Jerusalem uh, captive in the fifth month. What's this one? Then the word of the Lord came unto me, saying, Before I formed thee in the belly, I knew thee, and before thou camest forth out of the womb, uh, I sanctified thee, and I ordained thee a prophet unto the nations. He was talking to Jeremiah at the time, uh, Jesus. I, well, this, the, the, the Holy Spirit, the, the Holy Ghost, uh, or whatever he wanted to call it at the time, the Holy Ghost. I came forth from the Father, and I have come into the world. John 1, 1 through 17 is one of my writings, and this explains this. Again, I leave the, uh, okay, so the thought is ended, but more information is given, okay? So that's why it's written in this way with the, uh, I forget what they call those two dots. But again, it, it completes the, 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 state, uh, the statement subject, but it goes on to give more with another subject. I, can get, uh, I came forth from the Father, comma, so it's the same uh, thing. It's all, in it. all, it's all in it. And am come into the world. And it's like a period, but it's not. It's because it's, it's still within the thought. Now, the, the way of English writing. I'm, I'm a terrible speller, but my punctuation and, and design is, is... It's not bad when I'm lazy. When I'm not lazy, I mean. It goes, again... I leave the world, and you know it's it's bringing you into another statement of this thought again. Okay, comma. I leave the world, comma, and go to my father, and that's the cycle. So he came from the father 
to come into the world to bring the word of the Father for salvation. And then he brings us, who Jesus is the bright and morning star in Revelation 22, 16. And he gives us the morning star in uh, Revelations 2, 26, I believe, or 28. And then we inherit what Jesus inherits from the Father. And that's why we're all gods. And that's why it says, I said ye are gods. Does it not, or does it not say in your, in your law, I said ye are gods? Okay. But you're at a fallen state. As Lucifer was a cherub and he fell and became Satan. So he's just an angel at that point. He's not a cherub anymore. He's lost his position. So his name changed. Same thing happened to the disciples. Same thing in Jeremiah. Okay. When your position change, your name will change. It could be position that goes up or it can go down. As in Lucifer to Satan. And you're confusing all this by your own perception, Mr. Nolan. So I don't know if it's going to be satisfying or not. <laughs> not at all. To anybody out there. <laughs> but at least I do uh, show you from where um, I... <laughs> where I am directed in scriptures to justify the reason why I believe. Okay. Now, you went on to something else here. I'm going to, like, that's enough of that. This beauty. Okay. It, here it is here. You have yet to explain to everybody how is it that you would use this beauty in the proper way. Be Thank you, Lord. I prayed that he would bring this to attention. Because he'll understand what the problem with Jonathan Cleck and I have when he, because he hypnotized me. Because in the same video, you, you say that you think I'm jealous of your appearance and. It's not jealousy. It's a fact. Okay. I know it's a fact, but, and you don't understand because I haven't told you the whole stories all my life. I've had to fight off men coming on to me. Doctors asking me to drop my pants for no fucking reason. Excuse my language. But there's a reason why I'm so upset about that. No, I wasn't raped or molested or anything like that. But it, it had been tried on me. The same thing happens in the, in the forces when I explained that. Uh, they made me wear see-through pants in front of a, a bunch of people. Male and female. <clears throat> um... You know, just other things too. And it's not just my problem. It's a lot of people's problems. Thus, the uh, the video of uh, Follow Your Daughter Home, um, and which <laughs> Jonathan wouldn't play, but it says uh, location, location, location. He, he, he showed that because I, I knew it would get him. <laughs> because the soul does not die, Okay. The gods, as, as in small g-o-d-s, do not die. It's your location. And it's about going back to the Father or absence of the presence of the Father. So the first death is the absence of the presence of the Father. But in Genesis 1, Jesus recreated the earth. Yes, recreate. Because and if you go into the Hebrew in Genesis uh, 1, uh, they changed something. It, said, it says the Father God in it, okay, in the Hebrew. Um, and God created the heavens and earth, okay. And, and Genesis 1, 2, it says there was a, a water. The water is not explained on how it got there. But there was a Noah's flood. So Satan uses that as confusion. And water is not sperm. 
It could hold sperm as a fluid, but water was the boundaries that the fallen angels were put into until the time of salvation. And then you, uh, when it, the earth was built, there's still water above the firmament, the heavens, the air. The heaven, the air is called the heavens. There's water above it. Are the uh, are all the souls that are in the book of life in that water? And it comes through the woman's womb to justify your salvation or to justify your deception. And there's only one chance. And it doesn't happen over and over again. And it doesn't have reincarnation in it. It has the beautiful story of salvation from the scripture. That a man is to die. Let's just find that. So that uh, we can... A man is to die once. Okay, so Hebrews... Let's go to the King James. I don't usually do it this way. I usually go into the uh, Bible gateway, but this is just quicker. And it is appointed unto men and then women once to die. But after this, judgment. And that's why they think Elijah and Enoch are the two witnesses because they have not died yet. Okay. <clears throat> so, and if you think you're going to have uh, your wife in your, the new life that Jesus gives us, there's no given in marriage in heaven. The angels are as one. They go back to male and female as Adam was in the garden. As Jesus said, man is created in our image. Okay, the human, the light man, until it was covered in the skin sin suit. Okay, you cannot explain scriptures this easy, Jonathan. You gotta manipulate and use reversal and lie. You cannot use the full scriptures. Uh, I'm telling you, I would not change body with yours. Neither at a younger age, neither at this time, neither after it. <laughs> I wouldn't change my body with yours. And uh, for the sake of appearance, even. But I'm still asking also, how is it that you say you would use in a proper way this outward beauty that you say you received from Jesus. Oh, no, that's what you see so you can use it against me. What I said was, whatever God give you, you got to use it. For, well, I didn't say it this way, okay? I forget how I said it. I'm not going to go back, but um, whatever he give you, you got to use it for the good. That's all. Okay, he give you running. He give you a memory. Okay, why do you have to be so negative all the time? He give you organization. He give you a bunch of keys to burn in the fire. Okay, he give you a conscious and a subconscious. Just use them in the way of the light. That's what it means. You know, you talk about jealousy uh, and concerning the beauty outward of the flesh. And you say you got what Jesus giving you and you just got to know how to use in the proper way. How would be the proper way for you, my gather, to use the outward beauty? Would it be to attract people to listen to your message? What would it be for? Would it You're the one that said I had a funny M on my forehead and stuff like this, okay? You're the one that were putting me down, okay? I used that picture because of the mole I have. And Jonathan Kleck talked about the mole in one of his um, uh, videos back in 2017. Um, and also, he used the name Mike. And that's why you say, oh, his name was something else and this. And you made a whole big lie. 
with no proof. Oh, I know I have no proof, but it's uh, it's what I believe and the spirit told me. Yeah, the spirit. What spirit was going back to now? Okay, the one that uh, convicts everybody and says, uh, oh, you're, you're this and you're that. Uh, who, who give you the judgment seat? There's only one person that gets that. Okay, so uh, you're, you're, you're full of it. You're just full of it. I, I don't... I, I don't know why I do anymore. Be for to have many children with a woman because you know that uh, you say that for a woman to be saved, they need uh, we don't need, a woman need to give birth to be saved. With. Yes, and I showed you the scripture, and you found something that I never stated. Okay, now in the body of Christ, a man is to leave his father and cleave on to his wife. Okay, this is the faith way. If we have to mention all these things over and over, but we know what we're talking about, then this is just another way of showing how you are deceptive. Okay, you find all these things that mean very little. But yes, a woman can, is uh, through faith, she can be saved by giving birth. Because why? You're bringing the, the, the souls into this, through the matrix, into this earth for repentance. To take the word back to the Father. Okay? All flows. So all your ignorant arguments there are nothing but catalysts for my teachings. Okay? Because you're using... The Roman Catholic Islam uh, under the Silver Gateway Masonic teachings with jinns. Okay? Go look that up. You better study it. Because you're teaching it. Just false, by the way. But what would be your way of using your outward beauty in the proper way? Yeah, whatever. That makes sense because you cannot just say Use what God given you in the proper way and give this idea from the out. So if I went, uh, uh, okay, when I was, uh, I was built, okay, like I said, I couldn't read and write, so I did phys ed, a lot of it. And I would not let people beat me because I got ADD, ADHD, and when I put my mind to something, I do it. Or, God will stop me before, but I don't want to be uh, uh, pride, uh, my pride coming out right now or anything like that. Or it's because there is no pride in it. It got me nowhere. Okay. Um, <clears throat> two guys that I wrestled in high school were uh, um, 